Welcome back, everybody. It is the end of an era. The Nashville Sounds playing their last regular season home game today over at Greer, but they are sending the stadium out in style. News Channel 5's Cuthbert Langley is live for us at Greer this morning. So a ton of stuff going on, I would imagine, getting set for tonight. Right, Cuthbert? Yeah, there's going to be a whole lot going on tonight, much more than just baseball. It's Fan Appreciation Day here at Greer Stadium to really kind of celebrate and, and let the 37 years go out with a bang, literally. At the Nashville Sounds, they're taking on the Sacramento River Cats tonight. Now, they're two games back in the playoffs, so if they don't head over to the playoffs, this will be the last game ever played here at Greer Stadium for the Nashville Sounds. If they do go into the playoff, there could be a couple of games here, but no matter what, it's a big celebration tonight. Greer Stadium, of course, named after Herschel Greer. Greer, the man who really kept the little the minor leagues here in Nashville over the years. It's undergone several renovations, being able to host as much as 10,000 loud fans. That famous guitar has been lit up since 1993 for every game played here at Greer Stadium since the early 90s. And of course, you know, they're making way for a new chapter, the new ballpark there in downtown Nashville, just a few blocks back from uh, News Channel 5's studio. So tonight really is going to be a celebration of the fans and the celebration of the history here at Greer Stadium. Here's a little bit of information if you do want to come out tonight. First pitch is at 7.05 again against the Sacramento River Cats. They'll be handing out free commemorative cups to change colors. Talk about real cool for the first 3,000 fans tonight and they'll be handing out thousands of dollars in free giveaways. Tickets are already going quickly so on your lunch break you might want to swing by the box office to grab some uh, and if you are on your way into work maybe swing back here as well but I'm you know been searching all day you know last year at Greer trying to find the best seat in the house. I think I found it right here. The big old red chair. I already talked to everybody and they're going to uh, they're going to roll me in right behind home base tonight. <laughs> so we're going to have a good time. And you know, Steve, my last hit, I actually caught the ball. So I haven't it hasn't moved from this mitt because I think this is the last time the ball is actually going to touch the mitt with it in my hand. Outstanding. But, uh, we're having a great time, you know, so come on out. It's going to be a great night. I was going to say. And yeah, we're just having a lot of fun. Yeah, yeah, that's a good seat for you right there. I know the one place they don't want you sitting is in the dugout. Right, right. They're not going to be able to see anything. But I got my coffee cup here this morning, so maybe it'll be replaced with a nice little frothy beverage tonight, too. So it seems to be pretty convenient. <laughs> that looks good there. Yeah, very nice, Cuthbert. All right, man. Yeah, there Take care. Having fun out there at Greer. And you'll have fun if you go out there tonight. Don't forget, Sounds playoff tickets go on sale today, making the playoffs. So they may be playing at Greer, maybe a little bit more. Prices are the same as during this, the regular season. 12 bucks for reserve seats, 8 bucks general admission. The Sounds, like we said, could be playing at home in the league finals or maybe for the championship. Let's hope so, depending on how things go. We have